before I crack this box open, I just want to show you there's air duct right here. And then underneath you can see the return air that goes into the car. It's sealed up pretty good with this rubber seal on here. Be careful you don't do any damage to that. We're going to flip it back over. And then there's a rash of bolts here that we need to remove. I think there's looks like there's 10 of them all together using the Torx T20. And we can go ahead and, and zip all these out. This way we can access that filter. Okay, so now we've got all those bolts out. Pull this cover off, and here's our HEPA filters underneath. There's one charcoal activated carbon filter, and then there'll be another one underneath a secondary filter. These filters are required to be replaced every two to three years. This vehicle doesn't have that age on it yet, and you can see they look like they're in fairly good condition. And we're just taking this apart for demonstration purposes. I'm not putting new filters in this car yet. It's too new with only 12,000 miles, but I wanted to be able to give you a full demonstration on how that works.